Okay guys, so we are continuing. So what I have decided to do is to build some kind of telegram uh, telegram design for my no codlers, uh, my startup, my project. So let's refresh this page and yeah, we can see some designs here, how it's built and so on. So I'll figure it out I guess, uh, how we can make it really nice and yeah we're gonna keep that design it's cool so let's see what we got here all right okay <coughs> let's just start building it okay um, that's the most the hardest thing is to choose the design you like. <coughs> I guess that one is cool. It's not going to be the same as here, you know, but something similar, I guess. Yeah, this one is, is nice. Okay, let's go back. So first of all, we need to set up the theme, right? So we see the blue color and mostly it's blue, black and yes, that's it, blue and black. This one we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it like soft blue, the primary color. And the rest of them, they're cool, background is totally white, second background let's make it f1 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 okay primary text um, that one no uh, nope I want more yeah that one secondary text is here we can choose that one Bottom text, line, color, cool. And yes, yes. Uh, title, semi bold, semi bold, semi bold, medium, medium, normal, and normal. So, cool. Go to navbar, app bar, show navbar, and this one will make it zero elevation height is fine uh, primary color is white uh, icon we have our own icons icon color is going to primary text uh, size is going to be 22 uh, 18 18 is fine title title subtitle cool 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 Yep, everything is nice, cool. Mm -hmm. App assets. So here we have to do a splash screen and we have to launch your icon. Let's go to Canva. And first of all, we're going to do the launcher icon and then we're going to do the splash screen. Splash screen, we will animate splash screen, guys. So we go to logo. We can choose some kind of logo from here, but I will, I think it's better to build your own. Mm -hmm. And some kind of like text. Yeah, we'll just write like, no colors. I like that one. Position is cool, cool, cool. Share, download, download. So we have a logo. Here's our logo and splash screen. Do you know how to do the splash screen? I know how to do the splash screen and we will make it very nice, guys. So we have to 
cool. It's not with all the animations. JSON file. Mm, yep, yep. Go here, load it to GIF. Okay, so we need to drag and drop the JSON file here, but first we need to to design free animations. nice we keep the color as it is uh, so right now we need to download the file uh, download gif gif is cool gif done so we go back we come here app assets upload image that one Nope, we cannot play with that, so we just keep it white. Done. So this is our uh, kind of like splash screen once you open the app. That's what you're gonna see. But I'm we'll keep it for now, but later we're gonna change it. I will change it myself. We go to app details, we can enable deep links, but not now. Later. Once we will upload it to App Store, we will need to enable deep links. Here we can play with the um, like the loader. Mm, let's keep that one primary 50. Finish there. Language. We keep the language English. Authentication. Uh, when our exist homepage has to have a navbar. Okay, we'll do it, push notifications later, deployment later, Stripe, we will connect it, we will connect revenue cat in the future, GitHub, so how do we do in the GitHub? Okay, we create a new one, mm, no coders, I will do it private, need to add an, a readme file, without this file you will not be able to push to the GitHub. So we create a repository. Yeah, and just copy the link. I mean, there is a video on how to set up Flutter flow. For me, everything is done. So I don't need to do everything again. Like here you have, you have docs, here you have a video, I think. And you can easily do it. And we can push the repository. So, uh, Algolia will not use Algolia. We need to enable this one. We need to enable everything. Google Maps, we are not going to go use Google Maps. Okay, so, guys, uh, from now on, we will be building uh, all the other, like, we will be building the app itself, the design. Uh, it's going to be next lesson. So, this lesson, I wanted to do it very small. Yes, and yeah, by the way, one more thing, we need to go to settings in Firebase and deploy it. 
you have to do this one every time once you create a new collection if you don't do it nothing gonna work so yeah see you later guys